All right, good morning, everybody. We're going to go ahead and get started here. Welcome to the City of San Bernardino Development and Environmental Review Committee. It is a regular meeting of October 9th, 2024. The time is approximately 10.02. <clears throat> Could we stand for the Pledge of Allegiance, please? <laughs> Ready? Begin. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, and the liberty of justice for all. Thank you. My name is uh, Mike Gonzalez with the Planning Division. We're going to go ahead and take roll call. So, Guerrero, Land Development. Ryan Castillo, Traffic Division. Michael Warner, Water Department of Engineering. Chantel Choi, Planning Division. Brian Gumper, Building and Safety. Title by Earth and Security Waste. All right, thank you, everybody. <clears throat> so, we're going to open up uh, public comments for items listed and not listed on the agenda. Is there anybody here not speaking on any items today, but want to just voice their opinions on anything? All right, we're moving on to the consent agenda. There will be no separate discussion of consent calendar items unless a committee member requests that the item be considered in its normal sequence on the agenda. First item on the consent agenda is number one, approval of the draft minutes. And our recommendation today is to approve the minutes of the regular meeting of September 25th, 2024. Do I have a motion? Motion. motion. Wow, first and second. Wow. wow. <laughs> nice. All approved. Nine nines. All right, motion passes. Moving on to the public hearing items. Um, item number two, Chantal, can we have the project, please? So the item number two is development permit type D23-18. It's a request to allow the development and establishment of an 11 unit apartment complex within two buildings containing a total of approximately 16,000 30 square feet on a property comprised of two parcels containing a total of 0 0.71 acres. The project site is located at 466 North Sepulveda Avenue within the Waterman Baseline Specific Plan. The environmental determination will be 15332 infield development. Staff recommends that the Development and Environmental Review Committee adopt resolution number 2024-038, approving development permit type D 23-18, based on the findings of facts and subject to the recommended conditions of approval, and finding the project is subject to categorical exemption under California environmental policy. All right, thank you, Shantara. The applicants are here. <clears throat> Did you have any questions for the group? Do you agree to all the conditions within the resolution? Yeah, I agree. All right. Does anybody have any comments? Of course. Of course. Go ahead, Ryan. All right, I got the floor. So building number one, you have your ADA requirement met with this ADA spot. We asked for this parking spot to be ADA mm -hmm. and create the, the buffer zone for building number two. So that's my condition. So condition two is you got two bedroom, two, two garage, two bedroom, two garages. You got a four bedroom with two garage. You got a three bedroom, two, two garage. I asked for more parking spaces, but I guess the nearest bus stop is half a mile away. AB 2097 comes into play. Correct. Under subsection or section two, subparagraph F, it says you must provide... EV charging for your handicap spots. So because you have a handicap spot here and a handicap spot here, now I'm asking for EV charging. For those areas. So is this EV ready or do they need to have all the equipment already in place? You know, I would say EV ready, correct, right? Yeah, the building code says EV ready. Are you okay with that? So you gotta run conduit out there in a pull box and that's about it. When you do get it up and running and established, it wouldn't hurt to put time to parking on it because I can imagine a Tesla being there overnight. And then another Tesla guy is saying, this guy has a move that I want to charge. You get that drama. The other thing for building and safety would just be, you know, this pathway, if, if he's going to visit this, just this pathway is 88 block, like the four feet of line. You can get the I mean, I only check for my spots, but you might have to buy it in the middle. Yeah, I had made the comment that the corner 
Uh, the, the pass opens at the corner there. Here? No, up up from there. This this corner? No, right right here. Yeah. So this parking spot cuts off that corner. Yeah, so they're gonna have to shift the spots over and create a buffer just like they did with the room. Right. And then the trash and corner so have to be accessible. But yeah, other than that, I'm all right. So 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 we put these we'll put these conditions on the record. Um uh, Will you be amenable to putting these conditions to agree to these conditions? Yeah, we can do it neutral, right? Uh, okay, so so before we submit to the building department permission. Correct. And and you could change you could change up your site plan before you do that. Mm -hmm. Um however, if we sign the resolution and and pass the project, you might have to do a minor modification just to change the out the, the circulation mm -hmm. to change that parking and to push some things over mm -hmm. um so can we when is the revolution going to sign it you got, got the 15 days yeah. so if, if, if you agree on record to those conditions and those changes mm -hmm. we can make those changes before the 15 day period is up and we sign the final resolution are you agreeable to that so we have to just, today you're just agreeing on traffic conditions mm -hmm. and agreeing to alter the mm -hmm. site plan mm -hmm. to fit what we had just conditioned and that's it okay. and then we can go ahead and pass the project and have it revamped and signed before the 15 days or by the 15 days okay you're agreeing so okay all right so uh the recommendation was for the DRC to adopt resolution number 2024-038, approving development permit type D23-18, based on the findings of fact and the CEPA uh, determination and conditions of approval. Do I have a motion? Motion. Second? Second. All agreed? Aye. Aye, aye, aye. Any denies? No? All right, project passes uh, based off of the conditions that were just read. All right, thank you very much. And we're going to go ahead and uh, adjourn. Yeah. The next regular meeting of the okay. Development and Environmental Review Sorry. Committee will be held on Wednesday, October 23rd, 2024, at 10 a.m. here in this exact same room. Thank you, everybody.